Potassium is an electrolyte that plays a critical role in your body. It keeps your heart pumping, your muscles contracting, your gut digesting, and your nerves firing. But too much potassium can lead to a condition known as hyperkalemia. It all starts in the kidneys. They're responsible for keeping tabs on the concentration and volume of electrolytes and water in your body. A normal potassium level for adults is between 3.6 to 5.2 milli equivalents per liter. Anything above 5.5 is considered dangerous. Kidney disease is the most common reason for elevated potassium levels. Other common causes include certain medications, Addison's disease, congestive heart failure, and cirrhosis of the liver. Faulty blood tests can also make it look like you have hyperkalemia. You generally can't get hyperkalemia simply from eating too many potassium-rich foods, but it is possible in people with advanced kidney disease. Most people don't notice any symptoms. When they do, they're often mild, like fatigue, tingling, and bloating. More serious symptoms include irregular heart rhythms and a weak pulse. Your doctor can test for hyperkalemia through a blood test. With a mild case, a few tweaks to your diet may help lower potassium levels. In more severe cases, your doctor might recommend medication, IV therapies, or kidney treatment like hemodialysis. Hyperkalemia is a potentially dangerous condition, but it can be reversed. The key is working with your doctor so they can address the issue and get your blood potassium levels back to normal.